What is going on guys? Jason, go back in video. And today we are going to San Francisco. We have Jazz with me. Oh yeah, oh so yeah. We got <laughs> Brian in the back and Brandon. And we're going to San Francisco and unfortunately, Pokemon Go is not loading. So we're actually turning around and we're leaving, bye. All right, so finally, oh, there's a Dunce Farm at the cemetery. What? Dude, uh, the cemetery right there is a bay leaf spawner. Anyways, we have two 10Ks. Oh no, did they already? Okay, so I think they already opened. They might have already opened, so I just we just gotta see what it was, but we did get two 10Ks, I believe. If we got Larvitar, I, I think we're just gonna cut the video there. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got a Dratini and a Magnemite. Oh, we might have a 5K, okay, but we got a Dratini. That's not bad at all. And then we got a uh, good IVs, HP, attack, stats. Ooh, that's actually a really good IV Dratini. And then we also got, I think this is a 100% Squirtle earlier out of an egg. It has good IVs, HP, <laughs> attack, defense, stats, and it's a big one. So I think that one's 100% IV Squirtle. That's really awesome. Mistrevious on the nearby. There's a Dunsparce on the nearby. And we haven't even got to SF yet, so uh, <laughs> today's gonna be pretty lit. All right, so we're pulling up to the pier and a Chikorita spawn while we're at a stoplight. So I'm gonna Pinat bury that really quick and go for the Ultra Ball. Uh, we gotta get some more starters, but we are here and the nearby has been looking cool. I've seen a few new evolutions or uh, second stage or third stage. So I'm pretty excited about that. And we got a Chikorita, but we are about to start the adventure. So as always, if you guys please leave a like on the video, let's try to get to 250 likes if we could. Let's do this. All right, it's a little, fun. it's not focused, but as you can see, there is a Skarmory on the nearby, but unfortunately it's on the complete other side of the street. And that would have caused us to make like five U-turns. So we're not gonna be able to get that. But as we can see, it does look pretty lit so far. All right, and our first catch at the pier will be a Dratini. It's a fat one, 575. So we gotta grab this real quick. Gotta go Ultra Ball. Ah! If I can get a critical hit on this, that's gonna be crazy. And speaking of which, in our last video, we did get a critical hit on a Cyndaquil. And you guys are filling my comments with that stuff. I don't think there's actually been any information regarding how it happens. Like I said, I think it's completely random. It just literally happens. And it's weird because the two times it's ever happened to me has happened both on Cyndaquil. So I don't know if that has anything to do with that. I'm sure it doesn't because I've seen other Pokemon get caught with a critical cast. So I have no idea. But that was a quick Dratini. Actually, let's check the IVs on that. It might be pretty good. We already just got like a really good IV. Yeah, okay, never mind. It was bad. All right, next catch. All right, and now we have a 5K egg. Our egg hook, air, our egg look has been amazing. Oh, Tyrone! Are you serious? Tyrone! Oh, oh my god! Nice! Yo, we just got a Tyrone! Oh, good deck. Oh my, what a start to the video. We got a Tyrone. Literally, our last few egg hatches have been Togepi, Porygon, and some other stuff. But we just got a freaking Tyrone. Let's check the IVs on that. 260. If you guys don't know who Tyrogue is, he evolves into Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and Hitmontop. Alright, so not the best IVs, but nonetheless, a freaking Tyrogue. And there's a Dratini right here. What good timing. Okay, it's only 149, so I'm gonna Pineapple Berry that actually. That might be a good idea. Boom, and we got the Dratini. It's not gonna be good IVs, but so far, Tyrogue and two Dratinis. Not bad at all. Alright, now we have a 397 Chikorita. So, so far, I mean, San Francisco. Literally been ridiculous in terms of these spawns. Don't ask why I raspberry that. I actually don't even know. Um, I wanted the pineapple berry, but I'll take the raspberry instead. Probably better that we actually catch Chikorita. We're almost, I think so. we have way more enough than a bay leaf, but we might be almost at a Meganium. Let's check at right now, actually. Metric that V's on that, too. All right, we have 47 candy, so we're around 50. Not bad, yeah, not good IVs either, but again, like we've literally caught, like what, two Chikoritas already and some other good stuff, so today's been late, we've only been here for like five minutes. But now we're gonna go grab some lunch and I'll see you guys in the next catch. All right, so we're at a uh, nice restaurant and there's a Cyndaquil, so I have to get this for you guys. Throw a pineapple berry on there because it's only a 71. And we're not gonna ultra ball because we only have 23. So yeah, sorry I'm being quiet. Um, we're kind of in like a nice restaurant and I don't want to be obnoxious. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna yell. Fortunately, we got them and I didn't have to embarrass myself. Oh, we have 100 Cyndaquil candy. So if need be, we can get a Typhlosion if there's an emergency. But we're gonna wait till we get a good IV Cyndaquil because that'll be awesome. All right, and we ran into a Teddy Ursa. So we're gonna pineapple berry that to 315. And gotta go Ultra Ball just because I love my Teddy Ursa and I wanna get a good Ursa ring. I do I did catch one, it was a 1700 or 1650. But I think we can really get a, a better one if we can get a good IV one and power it up. And I think we got this one, right? Boom, we got it. That's gonna be another seven candies. So that's really, really awesome. Just a little bit closer to our Earth Ring. We're at what, 30 candy right now, so not too bad off. And there's a Mantine, and then apparently there's a Magikarp right here with really good IVs, so we're gonna grab that. This Mantine's only a 25. I mean, I'll just throw it a Raspberry, why not? Boom, we got him, and there's a Magikarp that apparently is good IVs, like I said earlier, so we're gonna grab that really quick. All right, and we ran into our first Totodol. We are gonna Pineapple Berry that, even though it's a 483, 
Boom, and we got the total doll. That's gonna be an extra seven candy. We're now at 39. Um, I figured that there'd be a lot here, but there's honestly not, we haven't even seen. This is the first one we've seen. None on the radar, nothing. So we're gonna wait till then, but we're gonna head over to another park down there. I couldn't tell you what it's called. It's not Golden Gate Park, but it's a park on the, like, next to the pier. So that park over there. We've been there before, and it's actually been good, so we're gonna go try that out right now. All right, and we ran into an Izumarill. This is a Pokedex for us, so we're gonna Raspberry that. I think we might have enough to uh, evolve with a Meryl, but this is a second gen, or second, well, it is second gen, but it's a second stage evolution catch. So that's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna add them into the Pokedex. Now we are almost, literally almost done. We need like maybe 15, maybe 16 Pokemon left and we're done. Something like that, like we're really close. I think we're definitely close to that badge. Throw them in the Pokedex, I did have a lucky egg on, so I got a good amount. And uh, boom, 331, not bad at all, but again, not, not terrible. So we're not really tripping, not too good, not too bad. But we did add them to our Pokedex, that is our second new Pokedex catch of the day. All right, and we're grabbing some shakes right now, and we just incense a Dratini. I think that is the best incense I've literally ever had. It's a 424, so it could be really good IVs. I'm gonna raspberry it. Okay, I'm gonna try to hit Ultra Ball. It wasn't a critical catch, but we could get it on the first ball. So that's amazing. Let's get to the next catch. All right, and on the way to the park, we ran into a Teddy Ursa. It's only a 14, luckily, so I am gonna Pineapple Berry that. Got a quick seven candy, really, really quick. Great ball spin, that's gotta be it. Great ball raspberry spin, or uh, not raspberry, pineapple berry, 14 CP, I think we'll be fine here. And boom, we got it. So that's an extra six candy, going towards our Ursaring, Ars Ars going towards our Earth string, and now we're at 36, and it looks like there's a lot of these on the nearby, or not on the nearby, but here in general, so hoping to get enough for an Earth ring today. All right, we have another 5K, here we go. Again, our luck has been absolutely, if we get something, if we're gonna get something, it's just, it's just what happens here. Elegant, not bad at all. So this is what I'm talking about. The last like five eggs, four of them have been a Togepi, Porygon, Tyrogue, Elekid, another 5k. This one's gonna be bad though, I'm calling that. This one's gonna be terrible. That's just how life is, watch. See, you can't get too good. We got a Ponyta. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta chill sometimes, so we got a Ponyta right there. I'm not gonna check the IVs on those. There's an Apom and a Drowsy. Uh, Apom is actually, or Drowsy is kind of a rare catch because there's not much that's spawned out here. But we're gonna skip out on those and we're gonna get to the park. All right, we ran into another Totodile. It's only a one night. Oh, no, no, wait, no, 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 no. Wait, I don't want to, okay, Pineapple Berry. Because we want to get that uh, for alligator. Not, not Raspberry, we're okay. Uh, I will go Ultra Ball just because, wow, my hands are that cold that I slipped. I will go Ultra Ball because it is a starter and I want to get those candies for sure. Probably could have got it with a Ghost with a Grape. Wow. Probably could have caught it with a Grape Ball, but nonetheless, we got it. That's an extra seven, or six or seven candies. So not bad at all. Let's see how many candies we have now. And we have 45, not including transfers. So we have about 50 candies. Not bad. We are halfway to a frog All right, so we were tracking down a Totodile and a Ledian spawn. This is actually a uh, Pokedex for us. I don't have a Ledian. I probably have enough Ladybug candy. But we do have a Ladian right here. This is going to be another Pokedex entry. That is three for today. Oh, my God. I think the best one so far has been that Tyrogue. That is absolutely, like, come on. That's ridiculous. Um, we now we have the chance of getting a hip on top and I don't know if there's a way to actually get one a hip on top I don't know if there's like a strategy or a secret to get it on purpose But I definitely want to get a hip on top because I already have a ton of hip on leads and chance Anyways we caught the lady and it's in our pokedex and now we're at like 205 uh, caught so far so not bad at all it's not good IVs, but we do have it there, and I think there's still, yeah, there's still a total on for us. We're gonna go grab that. All right, and we're still on our way to Totodile. We ran into a Bulbasaur, a 635. I want to raspberry that, but I'm gonna pineapple berry it just because uh, Bulbasaur candy is not as easy to come by these days. So we're gonna grab that Ultra Ball spin with a great and a pineapple. This is gonna be six candy and a really good Bulbasaur. I'm thinking. All right, boom, we got it. We gotta check the IVs on that really quick. But let's actually check that out right now. It, it is okay. It's pretty decent, so not terrible. But it is a 635, so that's pretty big. And uh, we're still still on our way to get that sorted out. All right, and we finally got to it. No distractions. We're gonna pin that berry that 338. So let's go Ultra. No, 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 no. Let's chill. We only have 20 left. Let's go great. That was terrible. Um, let's go great ball. Let's get it. All right, we got a great ball. Spin. Pineapple. Give me this six candy, baby. Wow. Don't run. Okay. None of the starters, luckily, and I'm probably jinxing myself, but none of the starters have run for me yet so far. Um, so we're chilling there. But Okay, great with a great ball. If this isn't a catch, then probably just going to leave because it's got to be. Wow. Oh, man, they're too good. Oh, my. Oh, there we go. I jinxed myself so hard. 
I just jinxed the hell out of my. Oh, well, I suck. All right, and we walked through the park. There was nothing but a couple of hot bibs, which wasn't bad, but we were about to walk back and a larvitar spawns. That's really awesome. We're gonna pin out bury that because we have like three. We have two tar or two wow, two tar <laughs> two larvitars and a pivotar. So this will be our third larvitar adding to the candy collection. We hope we get this. Are we gonna get on the first one? Hell yeah, we are. And by the way, I'm sitting like pretty high up. Like I'm, I'm on like top of like a church or something. But we got this larvitar. It was good. Uh, let me check the IVs. 259 shouldn't be good. Yeah. Not good, but we have 25 candy, so we do have enough to evolve to a Pivotar. And there's a Tangela on the nearby, that's kind of rare. Uh, we might walk over to that park and see what they have over there, but so far it's been pretty great. In this park, All right, we have a so Stantler here, that's, that's actually kind of cool. I thought that was kind of a cool catch. We're gonna Pineapp Berry that. Um, it's not, I don't think it's rare. I mean, you can get it out of 5Ks, but I don't think it's necessarily rare. We're gonna grab that really quick, but speaking of rare, there is a Tangela right here, and honestly, Tanglers are really annoying to catch because they don't really do anything. But they are pretty rare, so go ahead and grab that really quick. Especially now that Gen 2's out, Tangela's will not be common. So we're gonna grab that really quick. There's a Hobbit one in the nearby that we might grab. Boom, and we did get the uh, Tangela. We have 24 candy, and we got Sludge Bomb. That's actually not, that's probably the best moveset you can get for Tangela, but not bad at all. Now we're gonna go check out this park. I've honestly never, ever been there or seen that, so we are gonna check it out. It is lured up, so that'll be pretty cool, and Brandon just threw something at me. Can you throw it at? Ow! <laughs> He nailed me again. We're gonna go to the park and hopefully survive. All right, so you guys, we have a pseudo Wudo right now, but this is not the more important part. The more important part is that we were bored and we wanted to just walk somewhere, so we walked on this pier. Let me show you guys how big this is. So like all the way over there, we walked all the way around and all the way here, and we're literally right in front of Alcatraz, and we just came to the end of this, and we're like, you know what, there might be something here, and there's a goddamn pseudo Wudo. The reason why I'm tripping off this is because one, it is due to the Pokedex, and two, I'm gonna catch it with my AR on, AR on, and we're gonna catch it on Alcatraz. Hold on, hold on. Let me set this up. That is a beautiful picture. I'm catching a pseudo Wudo on Alcatraz. <laughs> so we threw him a raspberry. Now let's go Ultra Ball. Oh my god, it's gonna be hard to spin. Oh my god, I hit him. Okay, so I hit him with the Ultra Ball. There is a pseudo Wudo with Alcatraz in the background. Please don't run. Oh my god, don't run. All right, let's go Raspberry. All right, and now we have a pseudo Wudo on Alcatraz. We got oh my Jesus Christ, come on. We finally hit him. I had to hold, I had to try and hold the camera because I couldn't hold it and do AR because that was just way too much stuff. But we did get the suit. We did throw him in the Pokedex. That's five new Pokemon and it's been like, what, an hour and a half of being here. So we're going to add Suda in the Pokedex. We've seen him before, but we've never caught him. Boom, now he's in the Pokedex. Caught him on Alcatraz. I'm going to name him Alcatraz. I'm going to name him Alcatraz just because we caught him on Alcatraz. How crazy is that? Really? Really? Really crazy. <laughs> And there's a canopy. Oh my god. Just getting better and better. Alright, and now we have a chicken. Oh, no, 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 no raspberry. We got a pineapple berry, that boy. We got almost enough for a meganium, so we're gonna. Oh, no, no ultra ball. We are gonna chicken. Okay. Alright, we hit the chicken and we're catching it again on auto because that's such an epic place to catch a Pokemon. One, two, and we got it. We got the chicken down. How much candy do we have now? Jesus. Right, so let's double check that. Boom, 53. Okay, so I, I really thought we had more, but anyway, it's not bad. Now we're gonna go check out that other park. Let's get to it. All right, so we have a 288 Chikorita, and this is, so, this is like the fifth one we've seen today, so we're gonna pineapple bury that really quick. And no Ultra Ball, let's be honest. Let's go Great Ball Spin. Boom, all right, so pineapple bury, Great Ball Spin. This has gotta be it. One, two, three. Okay, please don't run. <laughs> I just walked up a 2k egg. Let's see what we can get. Jesus Christ. I, he would have plastered me. Oh, yo! No! Again! Another Togepi! I hatched another Togepi. This guy's cheating over here. I, okay, so my past six egg hatches have been Porygon, Togepi, Togepi, Tyrogue. Elicate and something else, but anyway, Jesus Christ. Okay, guys, we just got a freaking Togepi again. I swear to God, I have the best egg luck on the planet. Like, you guys, are you guys, like, shouldn't, I feel like I, I'm jealous of me. Like, oh my, our past five eggs have been Togepi, Togepi, Porygon, Tyrogue, and some others, and a Nidoran. 
But like I'm saying, our luck is literally uh, off the chain. It is it is ridiculous how great our luck is, man. Like I, it's unexplainable. I'm at a loss for words, and I'm really cold. That's awesome. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have more eggs. We've walked off so much today. We got two five k's. If we get another tight rogue, I don't know what to say. Polywag. Okay, you know, not not terrible. Um, let's. We got one more though. We got one more. Can we get lucky? Can we top these past egg hatches off? Can we? No. Stand true. Jesus Christ. That is the <laughs> worst one. thing you could have got from an egg. It's not. Um, I think it really is. Yeah. Is it Adam? No. It's you can't get those from an egg anymore. Oh, yeah. Good. So, <laughs> not terrible, but not. I, no, that was terrible. That was absolutely terrible. All right, and of course, we have more eggs. I don't know where these eggs are coming from, but I'm not blocking any larvae star candy, oh. so I'm kind of pissed off about yeah, that. Yeah, text me and let me know. Shelter, you know, I think it bounces out. All right, boom, 5K. Elegant, yo, this is ridiculous, yo. I know Elegant's not like crazy. Thank you. That's definitely really good. It's something. All right, and our friend Brian actually has a 10K while we're in a really nice store, so let's open this quickly and try not to overreact. Oh, what do you think you're gonna get? Is this a Gen 1 2? Oh! oh, oh it's got a flap. Oh my god. It's just, it's just oh my got god. a lap. <laughs> Yo! We can't That's over crazy. I literally. Oh, is that your high CB? Nah. Oh. Well, it's still. <laughs> How juiced are you? We can't be that loud because we're in a really nice store, but anyways, oh my god. Alright, now the camera's not focusing, but I'm gonna hatch these eggs because there's stuff spawning and I don't know what it is. Hopefully, it'll focus eventually. Another 5k. Can we continue our good luck streak? Drowsy. Not too mad, honestly. I, that doesn't ever, I've never hatched it, and it doesn't ever spawn, so I'm not too mad. Execute, we're, watching, we're walking towards the Dratini. Um, not too bad, but honestly, I think the highlight of today has been all the great egg hatches. Ooh, Dratini. All right, and now we walked into the Dratini. We are gonna pineapple berry this again. We are almost at 200 candy, so potentially two great uh, Dragonites, and we did hatch a really, really strong, um, what the, what's going on, okay. We did hatch a really, really strong Dratini earlier, so we are gonna try to grab this right now. Only a 200, pineapple, berry, and all, great ball, spin, give me this, win! Let's, that was, okay, let's go. Got Dratini, that's an extra seven candy. I'll take that for sure. How much are we at now? 173, yo, so we are, we are moving up the Dratini world. We're gonna make one more loop around here, and I think we're gonna cut it and call it a day. All right, and I think this might be our last catch tonight. We got a Dratini, only like a 300 some CP, but we are gonna grab this really quick. And I am in the way of a lot of people. Boom, we got the Dratini with the pineapple berry, so that's it. seven candy again. As always, this pineapple berry is so OP. Um, and obviously, if you guys didn't know, San Francisco is a Dratini spawner. I wish it was a Larvitar spawner now, but I mean, not, not a big deal. But, you know, today was honestly, we didn't catch a lot of amazing stuff, but we definitely caught a lot of good stuff. But I think the highlight of today were these egg hatches. Let me tell you just exactly what we've hatched today. That drowsy, that elegant, that polywag, that, Jesus Christ, Nidoran, Togepio. The list goes on and on. Regardless, we've caught a lot of good stuff today, and today has been magical. But I think the best place to catch Pokemon in San Francisco is in the streets, because that's where I've seen Blastoises, Dragonites, etc. So, we still gotta, we still gotta go out there. <clears throat> we still gotta ride through traffic and see how that goes. I'll definitely pop some eggs during that time, but uh, the night is far from over. There's gonna be more stuff in the street, I'm hoping, so stay tuned for that, and I'll see you in the next catch. All right, I told you guys the streets would be lit. We have a Dunsparce. We do not have this, so this will be a Pokedex. And I'm sure, I heard these are common, but I've honestly never seen one. And I, I mean, I saw one in the nearby earlier today, but now we actually have one. We drove into it in traffic. One, two, three. And we've caught like six or seven new Pokedex Pokemon today. So today has been literally like, it's just been amazing. I probably should have lucky egg right there. But boom, we got it done sparse, and that's just gonna add to our collection. All right, and actually again, we did run into another Totodile, so I threw a pineapple at that. Let's stock up on this starter candy. I mean, we have literally, we're almost close to 100 on everything other than the chicory. I think we're only around 50. Actually, I'm lying. I think we're around 50 for this too, but we're definitely stocking up a lot. Um, we caught a few of these today, and let's see. Now we're at 51 plus all the transfers, so it's pretty good. Two, two Squirtles, a Teddy Ursa, and an Ariadosa nearby. 
Um, hopefully we run into those. All right, and just in case, I'm gonna do the outro now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had a great time. We caught a lot of good stuff. Nothing really too amazing, but we hatched a lot of amazing stuff, and that's what's important. That means even more candy. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, leave a like and comment any other suggestions you wanna have or anything else you want me to do, any other challenge, something like that. Let me know what you've hatched out of the stuff I've hatched. If you guys hatched a Tyrogue, an Elekid, a Togepi, etc. I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the video again. Love you guys. Deuces.